There are no signs of Captain Cogren or his ship. We will have to continue the mission without him. Perfect. This will give us a moment to get our bearings and figure out how best to prevent the Iconians from escaping their doom. There are only 12 Iconians that we've encountered, so trying to deal with just those 12 will be a much easier task than trying to take on this whole world. Greetings of the Hall to you, strangers, and welcome to Iconia. My name is Mataravren, and I am a herald of Matara. Before I can allow you to pass, I must scan you to ensure that your technology is of a sufficient level for you to be allowed access to our city. This, your technology is sufficient, but your chroniton particles are substantially out of phase. Please follow me. You must speak to my mistress. Remember why we are here. Every Iconian must die in the bombardment, and their technology cannot be taken. If even one Iconian escapes, this could all be for nothing. I recommend we begin by infiltrating their government building. We need access to their data and the gateway controls. You've seen the ruins of a once mighty empire. This is Iconia at the height of its power. I apologize for the interruption, Honored One. These travelers have just arrived at our city. Their chroniton particles are out of phase. And per your instructions, I have brought them to you. Thank you, Matarwin. You may return to your station. Greetings, friends, and welcome to Iconia. It is highly unusual to receive visitors with such unusual chroniton signatures, and yet we have had two in less than a cycle. Do you know a being named Cogren? Wonderful. He will be quite pleased to reunite with you. You should be able to find him in the residential district. I imagine you passed through the same chroniton charge nebula he did. That would account for the anomalous readings. Since you are explorers like Cogren, I suggest you speak to Lemirin. She is the keeper of our world heart, a repository of all knowledge and a genetic record of the worlds we have visited. The astrometrics data in the World Heart could prove quite useful to you. Do you have any questions? Greetings, travelers. Are you explorers, or do you come seeking our wisdom and guidance? Either way, I apologize. I am rather occupied at the moment. Please, return later. I should have time to speak to you then. The changes we see in the Iconians are too great to be simple evolution. The Iconians shape themselves and the Heralds into weapons. Genetic engineering that is both efficient and terrible. You made it. Something must have gone wrong as we entered the portal that disrupted synchronization. I arrived two weeks ago. I remained cloaked, scanned the planet for several days, and then came to the surface as an explorer seeking to open diplomatic relations with the Iconians. My ship is using the magnetic fields above the poles to help conceal its presence. The Iconians of this time are nothing like the ones we know. They are flesh and appear to be friendly and peaceful, if a bit arrogant with those they see as lesser. Come. They will allow us to move through the city freely. You should see this for yourself. Cogren is either a fool, or he's being manipulated by the Iconians. Either way, he might jeopardize the mission. We'll need to watch him closely. Someone's calling for help. An injured herald. This could be a chance to learn about their physiology. Perhaps even find a weakness. Hello. Can you help us? 
My herald is injured, and I cannot leave him. I need someone to bring us some healing supplies. Thank you. There should be a healer nearby. Do you require assistance, visitor? Certainly. However, I do not detect any injuries or maladies in your physical form. What do you require? Oh, of course. It is our duty and privilege to care for our heralds. I will follow you to the patient. We'll see who the lesser race is. I have spent days among these people. They are very proud and very strong. The Iconian's affection for their pets is a weakness. We can exploit that. I am not so sure. After all, we've seen how the Iconians will transform their pets. The Heralds are merciless killing machines. They have killed multitudes during this war. Deaths that we will avenge here. No more waiting. We need to finish our mission. I don't understand why you're bothering to help these people. We need to find the gateway controls, sabotage them, and be done with it. This could all be over if you'd let it. Clearly the Iconians have a highly developed sense of the aesthetic. That's fine, but what we need is to know more about their technology. And we're going to a park. When you have technology as advanced as the Iconians, wonders can be found anywhere you look. We should talk to that officer over there. I see you are interested in this device. We are testing a new method of encryption. So far, it has proven to be most effective. To access the console, you must solve a series of problems that we believe only an Iconian could answer. Unfortunately, I fear the console is stuck in a testing phase, which is why I am protecting it. It may be a waste of time. You appear intelligent enough, but I doubt you or any of our other visitors could solve even the easiest of problems in the algorithm. I am not supposed to leave this area unwatched, but all of my heralds are performing other duties. And if Elmiran sent you, very well. Thank you, Traveler. I will not be long. Just as I surmised. The Iconians are following their own version of the Prime Directive. They are attempting to protect lesser developed species from acquiring technology that they may not use wisely or well. Not so fast. We've only heard one side of the story. I'd like to know what some of the other visitors here think about the oh-so-no 